This is a feature where if a lead provides you with a fake or invalid phone number and they keep coming back to your website to look at more and more listings and you want to essentially block them from being able to do that until they provide you with a valid phone number, here's what you could do. Uh, currently, if a lead provides you with a valid phone number, invalid phone number, they could browse through all the listings that you send them and you know uh, look at everything they need to look at. However, uh, all you need to do is set the phone number to invalid by clicking on the uh, phone icon here until you get to invalid to indicate that it is invalid. And then the next time when they actually attempt to open up one of the emails that uh, you send off to them, uh, they're going to be seeing this invalid phone number and it's going to make them change that number. So I'm going to put in here a number uh, just to actually get to the account activated and say continue. So it's going to send them a verification code that they have to put in to validate that it's their cell phone number. And I got it here. So 8641 is mine. I click on verify. Once I verify that, I now have access as a lead again to go through all the website and look at it. Um, as well as if we go back to the CRM system and reload, uh, we can see two things have happened. The phone number has been marked valid and the phone number has been changed. Uh, inside the CRM system. So that is uh, one thing that we've done to help you guys out with these invalid phone numbers. Um, and there's just a quick note for all of you out there uh, that are uh, working your leads. One quick tool that's pretty cool is activity. Uh, so to sort your leads by activity, most recent act, remember all you have to do is click on the activity field, show most recent first and sort them that way. This was already sorted so it shows that I was active a minute ago. Uh, just so you can work your most recent leads as much as possible.